As we hit the road to Sanford and the 32771 zip code, we're highlighting the things that make the community truly unique, including a high school that in some ways looks more like a college. I stopped by the Crooms Academy of Information Technology to see how they're getting results in our schools now while paying homage to their nearly 100 year history. Innovation is the wind in the sails at Crooms Academy of Information Technology in Sanford. So behind me you'll see most of the networking infrastructure that is actually used to power the school. The original architects understood that this was going to be an information technology school and they made this the big piece so that when people come in they understand that this is what we're about. Students at this magnet school get immersed in multimedia design technology, computer programming, and network systems technology. Welcome to our AI lab. Assistant Principal Clayton Donnan showed us the new AI and game design labs. The best part about Crooms Academy is it's allowed me to help develop classes that I always wanted as a kid. Students can earn professional certifications and have the opportunity for dual enrollment with Seminole State College. That means they can graduate from high school with an Associate of Arts degree. We start in ninth grade with career development. They learn to write a resume. They go on um, work site visits. Um, we do internships. A lot of them are paid because of the certifications our student earns. So there's just a lot of opportunities here that you would not find at another high school. And while the focus is on the future. It is my single greatest professional honor to serve as the 10th principal in our almost 100 year history now. So it's all done with a nod to the past. The Crooms family actually owned this property and donated the land to the school board of Seminole County at the time so that a school for African American children could be made right here. In the lobby, you'll find this photo of the class of 1929. The first graduates of Crooms Academy posing on Dr. Crooms's porch just a few miles down Sanford Avenue. It's a photo graduating classes now replicate. So we started seven years ago, mm -hmm. and here is this year's senior class of 2024. It's a very special moment for me in particular and for our students as well. It finally pulls all the pieces together for them to realize that they are a part of critically important history here in Central Florida and really nationally and globally when you consider uh, the legacy that the Crooms family had on this community. Julie Broughton, Getting Results, News 6. Wow. And it's so cool. After we did those interviews, we drove about 1.2 miles down the street to see Dr. Croom's house, which is still there, of course. So we checked it out. And they also have the highest graduation rate in Seminole County at 100%. Everybody and graduates. Yes. Isn't that incredible? It's a That's magnet fantastic. school, so that means there's no zoning, so kids can apply. And there's a lottery system to get in. But it was really fascinating. So. Okay, so a lottery system to get yes. in, because I'm sure a lot of people want to go there. Absolutely. Also, really cool to see that they've had only 10 principals in a years that's yeah. kind of shocking yeah dr. Crooms the founding principal he was there for 30 years Wow mm -hmm. cool stuff great yeah. story now we're gonna be highlighting stories just like this when we hit the road to bring our live broadcast to the 32771 zip code we're going live from Hollerbox German restaurant from 4 to 7 tomorrow stop by to watch you're gonna see a newscast behind yeah. the scenes there grab a delicious bite to eat or just say hi to the team. Well, yes. When we're not on TV, we'd love to say hi to you as well. Yeah, we're excited to be out there. Chief Meteorologist Tom Sorrells, you're going to be out there with us with some fabulous weather tomorrow as well, so we're so excited. Yeah, watch the little Magnolia Plaza, is that what it's called? Um, Magnolia Square, I think. Magnolia Square. Right? I call it a plaza, but it's a square. I I'll be there square. hanging out. Come see us. It should be fun, and the weather is going to cooperate. If it was big and stormy, I couldn't go.